Water is being heated and purified with the help of solar energy. A clever idea. Bolivia Wakam is a 29-year-old engineer. He studied renewable energy at an Italian university. After returning home, he started training young people how to install and use solar panels. And two years ago, he launched an NGO called Africa Tech Solar. Its aim is to promote the use of clean energy. The advantage is that the solar energy does not pollute the environment. It is clean energy, and it is also renewable. Renewable sources of energy can be used over and over again, and people don't have to pay for electricity because it is free. Wakam's Africa Tech Solar has already installed solar-powered street lights and a water purification plant in his hometown, Batu Farm. Lack of electricity is a serious problem in the region. In three, four, five years, I would like to see to it that the majority of Africans have this solar kit, especially in rural areas, because it is in those areas that are the most affected by lack of electricity. He is training over 60 people from Batu Farm. Today, they are assembling a solar panel at the local library. The trainees say they are inspired by the idea of clean and renewable energy. I used to see this kind of equipment, but I didn't know how it could be utilized. Today, I'm able to install a solar panel and assemble a solar lamp. Now, Wakam students are keen to make renewable energy available to others and it's urgently needed. In Africa, only two in five people have access to a reliable source of electricity.